Hi guys. So I want to share another story with you today. Today I want to talk about Marlo Hampton and is it time for her to become a full time cast member on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Now we all know Marlo came into the scene in 2012. She was brought on as a woman that dated the football player Charles Grant who was supposedly a person that Nene had an affair with. And this is what when we first we were first introduced to Marlo. Well, you know, that storyline totally blew up on Bravo. They ended up being really good friends and I believe we have seen Marlo in some kind of fashion every season after that. Without her being a full-time peach carrying cast member. And the reason she never got offered a full-time job as the for, to hold the peaches because of her past history. Now, we all know Marlo grew up in foster care. She talks about it every chance she gets. Um, she has a colorful past. She was arrested several times. No, seven to be exact. You know, but the biggest rumor was she was not asked to be a full-time cast member because she got in a fight with a friend of hers at a club and she allegedly stabbed her friend in the face and left her friend extremely disfigured. Several years later, the friend ended up killing herself. And the rumor is this is what turned Bravo away from making Marlo a full-time cast member. Okay, so, she, but she's always came back as the role of a friend. Now, I could see why they wouldn't bring her back, but Another thing that happened unexpectedly is the audience responds to Marlo. And they probably respond to her because, well, it's just no other way to say it. The girl's a mess, an absolute mess. But I like her too. I think she adds flavor to the show. I think whenever things go stale, bring up Marlo. She's been good friends with Nene and fell out with Nene. She's been good friends with... Kenya and fell out with Kenya and she's really the definition, in my opinion, people of true reality TV. Like, I, I hate to be mean. Yeah, I don't want to prey off of someone's, you know, confusion or mental conditions, but she's great television. You know, she's rumored to have been a escort in the past and also the ex-girlfriend. I'm told that she totally had an affair with Ted Turner, you know, the guy that started that little business on the network called CNN. Yes, people, he created CNN. And I'm all, it's also rumored that that affair led to one of the reasons that Ted got a divorce from my favorite, Jane Fonda. So she's a colorful person. There, I mean, I think you can go on for days with Marlo. I'm not, matter of fact, I think Marlo probably can hold her own show by herself. But the problem is, I don't know how she would handle her own show or full success. You know what I mean? We, When she's the friend, they have the option of bringing her on, taking her off, giving her a rest, bringing her on, giving her a rest. Because, you know, well, she's kind of, you know, she, she'll snap at any given moment, people. But I don't know. The fans are really responding to her. Is it time to let bygones be bygones? And is it time to bring Marlo on as a full-time peach-carrying cast member? I don't know, people. So me personally, do I think Marlo should be a full-time cast member? Hmm. I don't know. I mean, if it's not broke, don't fix it. I don't know. I, I think she should remain a really good cast Remember, like her and Shamia should stay on, but as a role of the friend. That's my opinion, people. But anyway, Monday was her first, no, Sunday was her first time on a Watch What Happens Live. She <laughs> is Marlo Quasha. She's a little bit Marloco. And this season, we have all enjoyed getting to know Marlo. Take a look. Do you have any right? allergies? Only to broke men. We are extra divas. You are the damn diva. And I think she did a really good job. I think she should remain a permanent friend. But who am I? I'm no producer. I don't know what's work, what works. I just know what I like. And unfortunately, when Marlo's on camera, I'm getting great storylines. 
Let me know in the comments section. Do you think it's time for Mar Marlo to get a peach? Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification button for more stories like these. Until next time, talk to you then. Bye.